Plagiarism is definitely something you want to avoid. It not only could cause you to fail an assignment, but could, one day, cause you to lose your job. But plagiarism doesn't have to be scary. This video will help you identify what plagiarism is and show you ways to help you avoid it. Plagiarism is the unacknowledged use of the words or ideas of others. Plagiarism also occurs when you misrepresent the work of other people as your own. Essentially, plagiarism is when you use someone else's ideas, information, writing, or thinking without providing the proper citation or attribution. In your academic work, plagiarism is not only poor practice and a form of cheating, but it also goes against university policy and the student honor code. Professionally, plagiarism is unethical, and depending on where and how it happens, plagiarism could be illegal. While this sounds scary, most plagiarism is unintentional, which makes it easy to fix and avoid. There are several different types of plagiarism. First, there is flagrant or deliberate plagiarism. This is when you use someone else's work as your own, on purpose, without giving proper citation or attribution. Next, there is fabrication, falsification, and misrepresentation. This is when you use someone else's work, but make a few changes to make it seem different or that it is your own work. It is also when you just make stuff up instead of doing original research or work. Most often, however, plagiarism occurs when you inappropriately paraphrase or summarize someone else's work. This usually occurs when you forget to include a citation or attribution. You can also plagiarize your own work. This occurs when you submit the same material more than once, usually to different classes, or when you take work you've previously done and use it in something new without proper citation. Finally, most plagiarism is unintentional. It occurs when you forget a citation or use an incomplete citation. It also occurs when you assume something is common knowledge, but it actually isn't. The easiest way to avoid plagiarism is to review your work. This means noting whenever you include someone else's ideas, information, writing, or thinking, and providing a proper citation or attribution. Remember to cite everything, whether it is a direct use, like a quote or reproduction of material, or an indirect use, like a paraphrase or summary. There are a lot of things you should cite to avoid plagiarism. This includes direct quotations from sources, facts, data, and information based on other people's research, paraphrases or summaries of another's work, ideas, opinions, and interpretations that are not your own or that you got from another source, charts, graphs, pictures, images, and raw data that you did not put together yourself, comments from lectures, conversations, and interviews. Essentially, if you did not write it, think it, or do it, you should provide a citation to help you avoid plagiarism. There are some things that you don't need to cite. That includes research and raw data that you've compiled yourself, like when you do a scientific study or survey, common knowledge for the audience or field you're writing for, this can include things like facts, historical notes, or general knowledge. You also don't need to cite your own ideas, opinions, or comments, as long as that information has not appeared elsewhere before. As you work, make sure to keep citations and attribution in mind to help avoid plagiarism. You should track everything you visit or use. This is where citation tractors like Zotero can be useful. You should also take notes and highlight passages you use so that you know to include a citation in your final product. Always put quotes around direct quotations from sources. This lets your readers know you are using someone else's work. You should also properly introduce quotes and any time you use another person's work as a paraphrase, summary, or example. It can be helpful to cite your sources as you write to help make sure you don't leave anything out. Finally, you should always review your work to catch any forgotten citations. Double check your citations and reference list or works cited page to make sure everything is complete and formatted properly. Remember, it's always better to cite than be sorry. It is possible to avoid plagiarism. As long as you track your work and provide proper citations and attributions, your work will be free of plagiarism. Thanks for watching.